right, you asked for it, and I listened. This is a song tutorial on how to play Someone You Loved by Louis Capaldi, and it is so pretty, and it's actually really easy to play. So I'm gonna walk you through it. We've got a free lead sheet for you to download. Just go to the description below, and you can access it there. We've got four chords, the magic of pop songs. I've got this in the key of D to make it easy and playable for people that don't want to play in more advanced keys. So we've got D, F sharp, A, A, C sharp, E, B, D, F sharp, and G, B, and D. Those are our four chords. So you can just play them like that. Match the chord tone with your left hand. Do that a whole bunch of times until you can do it without thinking about it. And then you're ready to begin. So the intro for the song is so pretty. It's based on the chord tones, but the right hand, it misses, it doesn't play the root tone. So you've got the third, so look at D has a root is the D, third is the F sharp, and the fifth is A. And the intro goes like this. So it's rocking between that third and that fifth tone of the chord in the shape. And then the left hand plays the root. Two, three, four. And then you reset that for A. So we've got C sharp and E. Two, three, four. And then we do it for B. So we've got D and F sharp, and then G, B, and D. And then there's a little sneaky move to the A. That's, that's the intro. And honestly, you could play that for most of the song as the accompaniment and sing over it. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. The great thing about this song is it can be so simple. So you could literally play a fifth in your left hand or root note and a chord here. So you could use root position, watch. Inversions, same chord, different order. Really got a way of driving me crazy. It doesn't really matter how you choose to play the chord. Somebody to heal, as long as you're playing it. Somebody to have. Whoa, we get that wrong. Somebody to know, somebody to have, somebody to hold. It's easy to say, but it's never the same. You could build. way more energy than you needed, but it was a thing you could do if you wanted to get a little more intense and exciting. And all I did for that build, same chords, one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one. Easy peasy. And then the chorus, just keep it simple. Now the day bleeds into nightfall. You can use octaves nice and heavy to give it some intensity. And you're not here to get me through it all. I let my guard down, and then you pull the rug. I was getting kind of used to being someone you loved. And then, if you want to, you could use the intro for the next verse. Watch. I'm going under, and this time I feel there's no one to turn to. See? It works really well. So, Lots of choices and this is great. I don't even want to make this complicated because it's such a beautiful song in its simplicity. The only thing that you should really watch out for is the bridge because we have a sneaky E minor chord. So you come off the chorus and pull around. I'm getting kind of used to being someone you loved and I, I can just pick any E minor inversion I want and I Like this transitioning B minor to the E minor. So really E minor, B minor, A, B minor, E minor. I'll be safe in your sound. Whoa. I'll be safe in sound till you come back around. And then keep it gentle. For now the day bleeds. You could do like a rock. Um, into nightfall and you're not here. rocking into the right hand, similar to that intro. I was getting kind of used to being someone you loved. And then you could, the next chorus could build into nightfall. And you're not here to get me through it all. All I'm doing is playing whatever chord 
I, not whatever chord I want, whatever chord shape I want, pulling the top two notes together and then rocking to the bottom. So D, top two, bottom, A, this is all root position just for this example, G, and if you wanted to use inversions, it still works. Go to town, it's notated for you, have fun with that. Sing along, that's also fun. And most of all, just enjoy practicing and playing the song.